Do you trust your own memories? We know our memories get a little weaker over time, but did you know some people have memories that are completely false? They remember things that never happened. Sometimes many people have the same false memory. When this happens, it's blamed on the Mandela Effect. People first noticed the Mandela Effect in 2013. That year, civil rights leader Nelson Mandela passed away. However, thousands of people remembered him dying in the 1980s. They described watching his funeral on TV. But in our reality, Mandela lived to be 95 years old. How could that be? How could so many people have the same false memory? Looking at the origin of the Mandela Effect, some famous examples, as well as some potential explanations for this strange confluence of perceptions, can help to shed light on this unique phenomenon. In a galaxy far, far away, the Mandela Effect exists. Yes, the phenomenon has even infiltrated Star Wars. While even the most die-hard of fans quote the quintessential moment in Return of the Jedi as Darth Vader saying, Luke, I am your father. That's not what he said. In actuality, Vader said, no, I am your father. The famous children's book series, The Berenstain Bears, is not immune to the Mandela Effect either. Many people report remembering the name being the Berenstain Bears, spelled with an E instead of an A. Also, many people remember the Monopoly guy wearing a monocle, but he never did. Mr. Peanut, on the other hand, does have a monocle. And do you remember Jiffy Peanut Butter? It never existed. It's always been called Jiff Peanut Butter. What causes the Mandela Effect? And is it real? A more likely explanation for the Mandela Effect involves false memories. When memories are recalled, rather than remembered perfectly, they're influenced to the point that they can eventually become incorrect. In this way, memory is unreliable and not infallible. It's very likely that small misspellings and miscellaneous name remembrances can be explained by these types of memory hitches. But what about bigger events? Let's take a look at the prevailing theories that have been presented about this. Multiple timelines and time travelers. A popular explanation, which many believe to be squarely in the realm of science fiction, is one of multiple timelines. In every good time travel story, someone goes back in time and attempts to change something. In almost every case, changing the past ends up changing something in the present, hopefully for the better, sometimes for the worse. In theory, this would result in groups of people having the same memories because the timeline has been altered as we shift between these different realities. The simulation hypothesis. Is life real? This is one of many questions that has plagued philosophers for thousands of years. Are we like Neo, living in a matrix-like computer simulation of reality created by more advanced, possibly post-human beings? and a simple computer glitch has caused a significant portion of the population to remember a major event incorrectly. Perhaps whoever controls the program we reside in decided to change things up and not everyone got the update. Parallel Universes and the Multiverse Some people say the Mandela Effect happens because we live in a multiverse. In a multiverse, other universes exist next to ours. Those other worlds look like ours but are different. Major world events turned out differently or never happened at all. In some other universe, the Industrial Revolution never happened. In another, dinosaurs still live. Thus, people who remember seeing Mandela's funeral in the 1980s may not be simply misremembering. They might have somehow slipped across from an alternate history where Nelson Mandela did die in the 1980s. While many have dismissed the Mandela Effect as simple memory errors, we believe it's worth looking at further from both a scientific and technological point of view. It's possible that the Mandela Effect is providing us with edge cases that could revolutionize our understanding of how the universe works and our place within it.